But in Alexandria, it was around 2.5%. Uh, but the obesity was in uh, Hammam, which is a part of Matruh, was very high, more than 85%, and it was uh, in Alexandria around 12%. What about the obstacle in this screening program? We got a lot of obstacle, a large sample. First of all, the financial obstacle, which is very grave. So for that reason, we only uh, made uh, 1,500 uh, uh, people, not 2,000, and we are aiming to complete the sample size. Also, the large sample size was uh, too many personnel are needed. These are part of the uh, screening program in, uh, in Siwa, in the military hospital there for the male and female sector. And uh, for that reason, we need a lot of personnel, a lot of house officers and, uh, and students to be trained. And too many blood samples and urine samples. And too uh, great burden on our central lab. For that reason, there is some uh, slow progress for uh, this project. There is only an obstacle that there is a dual data entry. Uh, it occurs on two stages. First of all, we entered electronically the clinical data by the, the, the student himself, and then the lab data come later. So uh, we have a dual, a dual entry, and this makes uh, great effort. The first history taking, the examination, and then all these data are entered, and when the data of the urine and blood sample come, we enter this data uh, secondly. So what are the future plans for, uh, for our projects? We are dreaming of wide scaling screening, uh, integrated uh, system application, the application of telemedicine, let's say we could screen uh, our people who are living away from our cities in the wide desert in our region, uh, just by putting uh, uh, the instrument there and the, the submitted data will be transferred to the central region. The application of the ge uh, geographical information system, trying to find any uh, link uh, or etiological link, I mean. Uh, the environmental screening and link this data to the, to the health data and all of this uh, aiming uh, at the end for control programs, for sound pro control programs. We need all cooperation so as to prevent this lady to reach the disease machine. Thank you very much. Thank you, Hela, for uh, entrance to the time. We have uh, five minutes uh, for questions. I would just like to congratulate Dr. El Wakil for a wonderful work. And I think you're one of the few people who are looking at non-communicable disease because there's no epidemic of CKD, the epidemic and the problem is aging and non-communicable disease. So well done and also well done for combining education with screening. So fantastic work. Thank you. Any more questions? Thank you, Professor Herr. Thank you very much. Thank you. We now arrive to the end of the session. Thank, thank you very much.